Hi ladies, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to create this look right here, obviously. Um, this is a Valentine inspired makeup look. You can use this at night, during the day, whatever you're comfortable with. I did a lower lash line liner. I suggest not doing that for daytime, but if you're comfortable wearing that, then go ahead and do so. But this is a very simple eye makeup look. I mainly use the Miami palette. Well, I only use this. If you don't have it, I'm going to describe the colors for you so you can go ahead and go buy similar shades or use what you have at home. You don't have to use the same colors I used. I'm also including four lip options for you guys. Um, one of them is what I'm wearing right now and I'm using Kat Von D's Lolita Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. Yeah. Let me know in the comment section below what are, what are your plans for Valentine's Day and hope you guys have a wonderful Valentine's Day. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. So let's go ahead and get started. Well, as always, I'm going to start by priming my eyes and I'm using this eyeshadow primer from Smashbox. And this is going to help our eyeshadow stay in place all day and all night. And it's also going to help our eyeshadows from creasing. Next, I'm taking a little bit of setting powder and applying that over that eyeshadow primer. So the blending process is a little bit easier. Now taking my Miami palette, I'm taking the shade Caramel and this is going to be my transition color and I'm applying this in Wilshire Wiper Motions. This is going to help us get a nice gradient from our lightest to darker colors. Now taking the color Sienna, I'm, I'm applying this directly into my crease to give the eyes more definition. And this is a reddish brownish eyeshadow. Makeup eats cocoa bear and some very similar shade. Now with any or with the same brush you used in the beginning, you want to go ahead and blend those two colors together so you don't have any harsh lines. Now taking deep brown, I'm taking this directly into the socket of my eye to give it a little bit more darkness. And as you can see, this is a very dark brown shade. Now I'm taking that same fluffy brush we used in the beginning and I'm going to go ahead and blend that color. Now taking the color Glisten, I'm applying this on my eyelid and I actually sprayed some Max Fix Plus into it so it, it gives the eyeshadows a more metallic look. This is a bronzy champagne kind of eyeshadow. It's very, very pretty. Then I went back into deep brown and I'm going to reapply that eyeshadow. And then with any clean blending brush, you want to go ahead and blend that. Now to highlight my brow bone, I'm taking Nude from the palette. And after that, I'm going to go ahead and apply my falsies off camera and do my wing liner. 
this is how the eyeshadows are looking so far now moving into face i'm using my neutrogena shine control and baby skin pore eraser to prime my face and for foundation i'm using my maybelline matte and poreless foundation in the shade 330 toffee caramel for concealer i'm using my mac pro longwear concealer in the shade nc42 and I'm going to be applying this under my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, a little bit on my forehead. I'm using the shade Earth from my Anastasia Contour Kit and I'm going to be applying that on the holes of my cheeks. Now to bronze off my face, I'm using Earth and Copper Brown and I'm going to be applying that on the perimeter of my face. To set the foundation, I'm using my MAC MSF in the shade Dark and I'm very lightly applying this. To set my under eye and that highlight, I'm using my Anastasia Contour Kit in the sh with the shade Banana and Nutmeg. And I also use banana to clean up my contour a little bit. Going back into the eyes, I'm taking deep brown from the palette and I'm going to line my lower lash line. And also to give it a more dramatic look, I'm going to extend that line a little bit. And this is great for a date night look you, you can skip this part if you want or you can do it whatever you feel comfortable with now I'm taking Sienna and I'm going to smoke out that lash line to highlight my inner corner I'm taking gold bar from the palette I'm going to go ahead and give my lower lashes a coat of mascara. Here I'm taking Rimmel London's Cold Liner in the shade Nude and this is going to open up my eyes a little bit more. Now using my Tarte Blush Palette. I'm going to be applying some blush. I don't remember the name right now, but I will have it in the description box. To highlight, I'm using this shade from the Anastasia Conjure Kit, and this is 10K. And here I'm showing you how this looks works with different lip colors here I'm using a light pink here you have a very rich red a deep wine color and a neutral brown I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you in the next one bye